Good evening, and welcome to another installment of music that I have, and you probably don't. Today we're going right back into the area of my music library that I like to, that I like to call music from people that should never have put out records. Um, today we've got a real find. Uh, this is Morton Downey Jr.'s record album. There it is, Morton Downey Sings. And if you're not familiar with Morton Downey Jr., well, I'm not surprised. He is a precursor to Rush Limbaugh, kind of a right-wing uh, spokesperson on TV uh, during the uh, 80s. Uh, this record came out in 1989 on oh, the lovely Compose record album, which so many of us are not aware of. Um but, uh, you know, you get a real flavor of somebody when uh, you look into their liner notes here. So let's just read a, a bit of Morton Downey's liner notes here. Uh, here's a handwritten uh, message from him. So we'll start there. Uh, this collection of music is filled with a desire for a better America, passion for our fellow man, and a sadness for the current state of our nation. Yet it is also written with optimism. We have the power to change the current course our country is taking and make it a kinder, gentler nation that our leaders often speak about. P.S. If you hear someone bad mouth in America, tell them, zip it. Morton Downey Jr. Uh, let's take a listen to the uh, first cut off of his record, which is incredibly self-aggrandizing, um, which means he likes himself a lot. I think this begins with chanting of his name by a crowd, yeah. It should be coming any any second now. Here here we go. I right. Well, there's a brand new name that's sweeping across America. Morton down a junior and talking is his game. He's brood and crude, polite and nice, says just what he thinks. Mm -hmm. But there's Oprah, Phil, and Johnny, and he puts them all to shame. Boy, does he. Well, he's the pit bull of the airway, the piranha of TV. Saying any damn thing he wants, from sea to shining sea. You love him or you hate him, Lord, there ain't no in between. From miles around, they come in droves. Young and old. See America's new hero, the blue team. One more verse. Well, I know he's to the homeless. Oh, that's nice. But there's those that think that any kind of work is a sin. Mm. Why don't they get a job just like everybody else? Instead of blaming others for the mess. Crud is crawling across this country. A creeping crud. The KKK and the skinheads. We know them all too well. Why don't you sleazy bastards who call yourself Americans join with one another on a one-way trip to hell? So we have some good well, calls. Right, so he likes himself quite a bit. Um, let's uh, take a listen to uh, his thoughts on uh, drug abuse in America. Probably my favorite cut off of the record. Let me see if I can find this here. Yeah, I'm going to get a little piece of the song before, but here we go. This song is uh, called Hey Mr. Dealer. I know you're going to enjoy it. I, I know you are. Hey there, Mr. Dealer, you drug-pushing son of a bitch. Messing up the minds of the kids of America just to make your fat ass rich. You're the sleazebag of the country, a 
garbage of our land. The devil is awaiting just to welcome you to your eternal promised land. Strong. It's a strong effort. Hey there, Mr. Dealer. I hope you're proud of what you do. But I've got a little bit of news, especially for you. You know that lovely child you used to hold in your arms so close. She just dropped dead from the drugs you Another cocaine overdose So take your drugs and shove them We've had our fill of them We won't blast in your ass It's on death row And your epitaph will read Here lies a man And that's it, folks. Thank you for joining me on another um, um, thrilling episode of music that I own and you probably don't. I'll join you again soon as I pull something else out, dust it off, and play it on the turntable. Bye.